this demonstrates uh, NOVA's native video understanding capability. On the left-hand side is a 12-second uh, segment. Uh, let me see if I can replay it, but where a game is going on. And what is distinct in here is, unlike most other providers, we are not sampling images and feeding them into the model. NOVA model is natively processing this video. So a lot of rich information on transitions, on how this active gameplay is evolving, is captured in, the resp in, a, in a very detailed response, as you can see on the right-hand side, and hand handwriting understanding task. So let's take it live, where we are providing the model instructions to transform a whiteboard, which could have been your <laughs> whiteboarding session with your team. And you want to convert that into structured information. And a single pass, it provides that information for you. So this is a text image, as you can see. We put a prompt in, and these are very high quality images that you could get. This is the impainting example of placing a generated image into an existing asset. And now you can see swans, uh, which on the, on the left side, it's not. Outpating is an input image of an Amazon truck and on a highway. Now we want to change that into a different background very simply by prompting it. Now you have the Amazon truck on a street. We also have a way to uh, use our own color palette to tune the outputs using hex codes, which is awesome. And also we could remove the background very easily. First one is the, as you can see in the prompt, slow cam of a man middle age 4K. Cinematic in a sunny day, peaceful, highest quality in Dalian. The second one is my favorite, a close-up of a large seashell in the sand, gentle waves, flows on the sail, and then a camera zooms in. A fun example of this is that a mushroom drinking a cup of tea while sitting on a couch, photorealistic. I can't imagine this happening, but uh, it does a really good job. The last one is a cheeseburger, a lot, very dense prompting, but it does a really well job of making a photo, photo, photorealistic example. What you're seeing here is a support engineer presenting the architecture diagram to Nova to ask for best practice recommendations through our support applications. Next, you can see the support engineer requesting Nova for cost optimization recommendations. Actionable cost optimization requires understanding customer architecture and applying AWS best practices. Finally, the support engineer proceeds to request Nova to generate the CDK code to implement the recommendations. This illustrates Nova's capability to generate accurate CDK code. Here, Nova created cloud formation templates implementing cost optimization best practices like S3 intelligent tiering and generated cost estimates to meet customer requirements. In the gripping second season of Bosch Legacy, Harry Bosch finds himself entangled in a co I showed you the final product, which is very polished, very cinematic. The question, how did we do that? How do we take 10 hours, I mean 10 episodes, over seven hours, and turn it into a three-minute recap? Well, there are three piece, major pieces. The first one is synopsis generation. What really happened? The third, second part is voice synthesis. And the third one is turning it into video, which is a visual montage. Hello, everyone. I'd like to show inspection. you some capabilities within Q Developer that helps you find and describe the resources within your account. Here, I've got Q Developer opened up on the right, and I can ask simple questions like list my EC2 instances. Q Developer will go and look at the region that I'm currently configured in, or explicit region that I ask about, and find all the uh, instances in that region. And here we can see that we found 10. Uh, EC2 instances and US East 1. I can quickly jump into any of these instances 
I can also ask you follow-up questions about any of these particular instances. So I can say, which EBS volumes are attached to the instance? And I'll give it the instance ID. And here we can see the results. It'll list out the EC2 instance that I'm asking about as well as all of the EBS volumes attached. Here we can see the, there's only one EBS volume and I can quickly get information about it. Oh, this has been helpful. Thank you very much. So here's an example of, I want to straight, uh, jump right into the video uh, to show you the quality and also how it looks like of using Amazon Reels to create a video ads.